The Societal and Economic Costs of Toxic Environments Diseases in children caused by toxic chemicals in the environment carry very great social and economic costs. Development of information on the costs of disease is important in the formulation of health policy and for convincing policymakers, who must make hard choices among many competing demands, that childhood diseases of toxic environmental origin should be a high priority. For example, a recent analysis of the medical and societal costs associated with four categories of illness of environmental origin in the United States of America, which included lead poisoning, asthma, cancer, and neurobehavioral disorders, found the costs to amount to $76.6 billion annually. The principal contributor to the costs is the lifelong reduction in intelligence that results from exposures in early life to neurotoxic chemicals that erode intelligence, such as lead, methylmercury, and PCBs. Widespread loss of intelligence imposes great burdens on society for services, such as vocational training and special education, and leads to lifelong reduction in economic productivity. On the other hand, prevention of environmental disease can yield great economic benefit. Reputable researchers in the United States of America have estimated that the increases in children's intelligence and thus in lifetime economic productivity that resulted from the removal of lead from petrol only have produced an economic benefit of between $110 and $319 billion in each birth cohort born in the United States since the 1980s through the increased intelligence creativity and economic production of generations of children who have grown up with only low-level exposures to lead. Likewise, the cleaning of air in the United States of America that followed passage of the Clean Air Act amendments of 1990 is estimated to have yielded cost savings of $2 trillion, mainly in reduced health care costs and increased economic productivity which is technically an economic benefit of about $30 for every dollar invested in air pollution control. Copyright Academy House www.academy.house